now is Josh. How are you? Hi, how are you? Good. And you're representing all 82 of the McDonald's here on Long Island. What are you guys up to today? Oh, <laughs> well, today we're celebrating our partnership with Long Island Cares, and we uh, partner with different organizations on Long Island to serve and support the community. Obviously, in McDonald's, we serve thousands and thousands of families every day. Today, we're uh, celebrating our food drive that we'll be having all through this holiday season. We have these boxes in the lobby of every McDonald's on Long Island, and customers can come and deliver unopened boxes of food. Anything unopened, we'll take it. Okay. And stop by your uh, local McDonald's, drop it in the box, and we'll get it over to Long Island Cares. Well, congratulations. I think it's a wonderful effort. The community spirit is definitely here today, so it was nice to meet you. Thank you. Yes, and happy holidays to happy all holidays Long Islanders, to right? Okay, Absolutely. thanks again, Josh. Right. Appreciate it. Okay, no stranger to live it up. He's been on my show many times. It's Paul. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. It's so great that you're here. I'm really happy to be here. Uh, through networking, that's actually how I got invited. I was at the Fair Media Council and one nonprofit helping another nonprofit. So you're here today. Tell us about this experience. Well, this is absolutely uh, fantastic. You've got McDonald's franchises all over Long Island, both counties raising food to support Long Island Cares and the Regional Food Bank, and raising awareness of the issue of hunger on Long Island that, as you know, impacts about 11% of the total population, more than 316,000 people, including 70,000 children. And partnering with the Girl Scouts in both counties, and partnering with one of the largest you know, chain corporations in the world, uh, to make a difference, and I think it's uh, going to do it. And you know, look what they've done with the boxes and decorated them, and just made it so appealing for people to walk into McDonald's. So buy a hamburger and drop off a can of food, and you're going to feed a lot of people. I'm so excited about this. I truly am. I'm a big McDonald's fan. It was my first job, um, and I'm also a big fan of Long Island Cares. You know that. And I was also a Girl Scout. So I mean, for me, it's like the triple trifecta of goodness today. How can how can you not win? It's fantastic. All right. Well, thank you so much. Good to see you, and I wish you all the best. Thank you, and have a happy holiday. Thank you. You too. Yay! Collecting food. Woohoo! All right, the Girl Scouts are out in big numbers today. NASA and Suffolk joining teams. Uh, really excited for the benefit of Long Island Cares. You're going to be able to drop off food and non-perishable items to the 82 McDonald's, and you're going to be looking for the boxes that the Girl Scouts decorated. Yay! Yay. How long have you been a Girl Scout? Oh, wow. <laughs> well, I've worked for the council for 31 years. I was a Girl Scout for, oh, maybe 18 years before that. And I always think that, you know, whether it's uh, doing good things in the community or earning a badge or something like that, the Girl Scouts are out in big numbers now. It's, it's a, almost like it's having a revitalization. Mm -hmm. I, I think we are seeing a revitalization of it. Uh, our numbers have held almost steady. We've had a little decline as the school population declined, but we're holding the, our share of the population. So we're very happy to see it, and girls are staying in and going all the way to the end and doing fantastic gold award projects. So we're very happy about that. That and makes a big difference in the community. It absolutely does, you know. Um, once a Girl Scout, always a Girl Scout, right? So, and how about you? Tell us about your experience and how you're feeling about today. Uh, well, I think today what's going on here is wonderful for the community. I think it's a great opportunity for the girls to get out there and, and, and serve and help others. Um, so we're very excited to be here. Great. Representing Troop 1021, how are you? Great, how are you? Very, very well. So this is very exciting. It's like we've got McDonald's, we've got Long Island Cares, and the Girl Scouts. And what are you guys doing here today? Today we're um, showing that it's great to like donate food to people in need and that everybody could do it. It's, it's really easy and it's really great to help the community for people in need. I agree 100%. Now, did you help decorate boxes? Um, yes, I did. Excellent. And um, when somebody came up with the idea, uh, how did you guys come up with the concept of what to put on your box? We, um, we thought it would be really nice to like, like, arrange things in like size order. It would be like really nice so you could see everything. Great idea. It looks beautiful. And uh, how are you celebrating uh, the holidays this year? Do you celebrate with your family? And what's your favorite thing to eat? I do celebrate my family. With my family, we have it all. We have it over at our house, 
And I really, really like to eat the Italian food that my mom and my grandmother make. It sounds good. I hope you have a wonderful holiday. And thank you for helping so many here on Long Island have a great holiday, too. You did a good job. Thank you. You're welcome. Island wide, uh, it's happening here at McDonald's. So go to your local McDonald's, please bring a non perishable item and um, have fun. It's going to be a great holiday for many people on Long Island, thanks to you.